guys, I've got 1080p monitors. Can I get 4K on there? That's what we're going to look at today. I have an NVIDIA 1070. Yeah, I know it's kind of old, but I don't game a lot, and it does everything I need right now, so that's what I'm rolling with. Uh, but anyway, in NVIDIA, you can use a feature on a lot of their graphics cards called DSR, which is Dynamic Super Resolution. I'll give you guys a link if you haven't heard about it. You can read up on it. But essentially, it allows you to... Uh, leverage higher resolutions on monitors that are only capable of let's say 1080p. So that's what we're going to look at today. Right now my monitors are set to 1080 and that's the highest resolution I'm allowed to set on it the way things sit today. And OBS, which I'm using to film, is set to 1080 as well. So let's take a look at that. I've got two monitors. I picked these guys up from Best Buy actually like I don't know five years ago. 27 inch Dells. I got them for 89 bucks. They were on sale so I thought it was a pretty good deal. Obviously not 4K though. Okay, so let's, sorry, let's take a look at my display settings. That's where I wanted to go. <clears throat> okay, two monitors. So let's look at the second one, which is the one that's on the screen. Uh, highest resolution I can go right now. There's no other uh, resolutions above it. 1080. Same thing for the first one. 1080. Can't go any higher. So we're going to close out of there and we're going to launch the NVIDIA control panel. Uh, by the way, guys, the reason I really started digging into this, um, thank you. One of my viewers called me out and said, dude, I'm watching your videos in 4K and they look like crap. They're blurry. And I'm like, wait, what? So then I start <laughs> digging into it and I'm like, oh man, what a noob, right? Like here I am editing my videos and rendering them out in 4K and I'm recording in 1080. So that's probably going to be the issue if I had to guess, um, I know my channel is like 12 years old, but I've only really been doing YouTube for like a year and a half, taking it seriously. Uh, it's not my full-time job yet. Maybe one day, right? You can only dream. But I'm learning as I go, guys. So when you guys call me out on stuff like this, thank you. You're not going to hurt my feelings. I might feel like an idiot, but you know what? That's how we learn. That's how I learn the best, right? When I fail and I get called out, I remember those things. That's great. So thank you for calling me out, dude. All right, so this is the NVIDIA control panel. When we go to manage 3D settings and we go to DSR factors, that was turned off. So I'm going to check the 2X and the 4X, the 4X being the uh, 4K capability. Hit OK. When I apply this, the screens will flash black. And they're back. Okay, so that just enabled the setting in NVIDIA. As you'll see here, our display settings should still be 1080 right now, but we should see the capability to go up to 4K. And there we are. Okay, so right now we're at 1080. I'm going to switch this to 4K. I'm going to keep the settings. Now remember, guys, this is going to look really funky right now on the screen because I'm recording in OBS at 1080. So I'm going to stop the video right here. I'm going to change those settings, and I'll be right back. All right, guys, we're back. I have changed the resolution on both my monitors to 4K and I have updated the settings in OBS, so now we are recording this in 4K, or I guess as 4K as you can get on a 1080 monitor. Uh, that obviously following the change we made in the NVIDIA control panel, turning on DSR and selecting 4K. All right, so let's see what everything looks like now. Um, on my end, obviously it looks like everything shrunk down, and it's not super clear to me. Maybe if you were playing a game, this would look really good. But, I mean, it's acceptable. I can record in this and see what I'm doing. I'm really curious to see how the video looks right now as opposed to how the video looked when I first started it. Um, so I'm going to zoom in on this. It doesn't look bad. It probably looks similar to what it did in 1080 as far as the crispness here. I don't know that it got any worse. Um, obviously, when you're zoomed out like that, it's harder to see. Not zoomed out, but when you're at 100 and this had to scale the resolution back down, um, it's harder to read, but as far as the actual um, crispness of the picture, I don't think it got any worse. Obviously, my monitor is still doing 1080 right at the end of the day, but what you guys are seeing if you have a 4K display is hopefully 4K quality. Uh, hopefully, that's not too confusing. <laughs> All right, so let's look at like a picture like this. I'm just trying to get different samples here to see what it looks like. Uh, let's go to another web page where there's some more text. I think when you have really stunning high definition pictures, it's harder to tell if something's blurry or not. Um, let's go to like Google Images. Let's look up 
uh, I don't know, surfing pictures. Let's open something like this. We're obviously not full screen or anything. This doesn't look bad on my end, but again, I'm curious to see if this looks 4K. Let's just go back here and see if we can't get a full full screen picture. Let's download this picture. It's going to be a WebP file. Well, that's probably as big as we'll get it right now. Um, I'm not sure the quality of this image to begin with. So, again, maybe these aren't the best samples. But I think we should be able to tell whether or not it's 4K quality. Might be safer to base it off of the text on the screen, to be honest. Stuff like this. And I can read through this entire article. There may be additional settings. Like in here, there's settings smoothness and things like that uh, that may help the cause. But to be honest, it's not the greatest resolution for me personally when I change this. So I probably wouldn't leave it like that outside of recording videos. But again, I'm really curious to know what this looks like. I'll, I'll probably stream this on my TV later that I do have 4K resolution on. Uh, to get my own thoughts, but I really want to hear what you guys think. The beginning of the video when I was in 1080 versus after I made the changes uh, to 4K, what does it look like? Does it look like crap? Give me the straight dope. Give me the honest truth. Because um, if it does, I'll likely go to uh, 4K monitors sometime in the future. I don't have the cash on hand to do that right now, but I'll save up and make that investment later. I did want to make a little um, office maybe in my garage so I can always reuse these 27 inch monitors out there uh, just for working on other stuff. Doesn't have to be uh, video creation. All right, guys, let me know how this looks. Let me know what you think about DSR. Um, let me know if you think this is a good idea or if I just need to go 4K. Again, I don't game. Um, it, when I do game, it's like retro games, to be honest. So I think I can use 4K monitors on my NVIDIA 1070 because, again, I'm not going to be doing anything crazy on it. But then again, I do make videos and edit videos and stuff like that. So give me your guys' thoughts. Uh, is 4K a good investment for me as far as monitors? But more importantly, give me your thoughts on what this looks like. All right, guys, let me know. Have a good day.